Hello houseplant friends and welcome back to my channel. Today I want to share with you extremely extremely exciting video and I know that I say this a lot but trust me this one will be so much fun. So I don't want to talk a lot about it because it's probably going to be not that short of a video so be prepared, grab a drink, a snack because we'll have a lot of fun in here and I, I won't be alone in this video, you probably already know this by the title but today I will film together with my friend Pamela from Pamela P channel I will leave all the links to her Instagram, to her YouTube channel in my description box down below so don't forget to go and check her out but today we're doing very interesting challenge so you, if you have been on my channel for a little bit longer, at least since Halloween, I did very similar collab with another YouTuber, Vea Majika. I will leave a link in somewhere up here. Uh, we did a fairy garden competition, but Halloween edition. So it was a spooky fairy garden. I have actually mine over here. Let me show up close. So this is the fairy garden I made with her. And as you can tell, Fetonia is already dead but other plants i mean even a fern is completely okay so this was my fairy garden that i made and today we're going to make another one since that one was halloween edition but right now it's february and when you're watching we're really close to the valentine's day so i thought why not to make another competition but this time this one will be valentine's edition so once again very interesting challenge because we'll have 20 dollars budget Fuck you. Fuck you, just give me his butt. This is the butt. <laughs> butt scratches. This is the wrong time, baby. Each of us will have $20 budget and we will be able to go to only one single store, you know, big box store, grocery store, whatever. For me, it will be a little bit more challenging because in Lithuania, we're still in lockdown. So the only shops that are open are the grocery shops. So I will try to figure out something, you know, I have no idea how this will go because you know that grocery stores don't have that many plants and I'm not even talking about the pots and you know decorations for fairy gardens. So I will really need to use the imagination and I'm really excited because this won't be my first fairy garden. So I am pretty confident but at the same time I'm really nervous. So just like I said, grab a snack. And right now I will insert the footage from my shopping and from Pamela shopping. Pamela already shopped yesterday and I will do it right now just after filming this part of the video. So I will combine our shopping videos somehow <laughs> and then stay tuned for our live reporting, porting, making, creating. So we have a lot of fun, we will chat, you know, share our experiences and just have a lot of fun. So. I'm really excited, but right now, without further ado, let's go shopping! Okay, we don't have much. But we do have some cute cacti. That insane money plant, guys. So many new leaves are coming, and it's out of the pot almost. How cute! Oh gosh. Okay, so for now, plan is maybe work with succulents and cacti because here are some decent varieties. 
and prices are pretty low, which is a big, big plus. So, I'm not sure what about the dish, what kind of dish I'll be able to find, but after finding a dish, I'll probably will come to see a little bit more succulents in here. So it's really late, just got out of work. I have to go ahead and get some plants and maybe some figurines for my video with Svetlana. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get me some stuff, you know, and see what the stores have. There's not much good things around, but I'm gonna try my best and see what I can find. So let's go. Excuse me, where do you have your garden stuff? Like plant pots. Okay, thank you. Oh my gosh! Oh, they have some terracotta pots. Oh yeah, this place has potential. Oh, they have some cactus. Oh, thank you. Oh, yeah. So So much potential in the shop. I'm like, oh my god, oh my gosh. I should get something like this. I should get something like this. Next time, Svetlana. Next time. But so many options of stuff that can be used. Alright, well, I'm not gonna wild out because I do have a budget of $20 and plants cost money. So. Lana, this is tough. Twenty dollars. Twenty dollars. Oh, Firefly, fam. Salty pecan, fam. I'm so excited for this video. I cannot wait for you all to see. I don't know what I just came across, but there is this freaking plant shop behind me. I don't know. It's not. It's just a store. And how dare they have a fucking Boya Carnos a compacta. If you are followers of my channel, then you know how I feel about Hoya Carnosa compactas. I am obsessed with them. They are my favorite plants ever. My favorite Hoyas ever. And how dare they have one. So large. So grandiose. Look at this jade plant. And my girl, y'all. Guys, I'm already back home. Jess just went to my doorstep and I want to show you everything that I got because I'm really excited. I think I might win. I think I really might win because it was extremely lucky shopping. So first of all, <laughs> I've got some animals. Okay guys, so I got some animals because I will work on a desert themed fairy garden so I thought why not to use some antelopes or I don't even know Pro totally not cows <laughs> but I'll find something from this and we'll make it work then I've got these decorations with hearts and I'll just you know insert some of the sticks all around the garden you will see I have and you know I already have an idea in my mind so this should be fun as well so since we're working on Valentine's Day fairy garden and there wasn't too much choices, I also got this. This is a castle actually. We have this real castle in Lithuania. It's called Rudonis Pilis. And I just thought since I work on desert themed fairy garden and I have a bunch of hearts, this one might be like, you know, a castle with, with a princess waiting for her prince, charming. So, you know, this one will give a little bit more of Valentine's Day vibes. So, I got three cacti and one succulent. One of these cacti is Gymnocalysium. Really, really cute variety. Then we have this gorgeous mammillaria. In one package for one euro and nine cents. And we go... For one euro and nine cents, I got three different cacti. This is really, really exciting and really lucky find. So this one, for example, is Crassula Port... Oh my gosh. Crassula Portulacaya Mini. 
and this is just a simple you know jade plant but i love that it's already you know sun stressed and has these beautiful red edges and last plant but not least i got this beautiful ferro cactus i actually already have one like this but i just love the color i love how dusty blue greenish it is why you don't focus there you go this is the thing that i got in from the dish section and it's this vase so this is this a vase yes this is a vase for flowers but i think this one will work perfectly for the fairy garden it will look like a terrarium it would be even more perfect if i would work with plants like ferns for example but i'll just put in here lots of different pebbles orchid barks prayer lights so we should be fine all in all i have a receipt for you so you you would know i'm not lying i was under 20 euros budget and for everything i paid 16 euros 89 cents i'm still in game you know i did everything i could for now so right now in lithuania it's around two hours o'clock so it's time to go and get some lunch actually and pamela soon should wake up she lives in new york so you know we have some hours differences and today at 5 p.m we will make this challenge happen get ready soon competition will be happening i mean in a couple seconds three two one let's do this i'll win hi guys welcome back finally evening is here for me morning for pamela say hi to her <laughs> so we are ready for some action we're prepared all of the stuff around us and this is where the tension should come to the sea <laughs> i will win so we'll leave in the that, description okay? box right no in the comment section Leave which team you're on. Are you Team Svetlana or Team Pam? Yeah, Team Salty Pecans or Team Fireflies. <laughs> okay, let's see. Let's see. The let's fireflies see. are gonna eat the pecans. <laughs> okay, so guys, the funniest thing is that we both have cacti, so this will be so much yes. it's so interesting to see the contrast between our ideas, you know. We have all of the stuff. We were holding on to our uh, budget, so each of us spent yes. seventeen dollars slash euros, which is exciting yes. and fun. Seventeen. That is 17, very exciting, 17, right? <laughs> seventeen, seventeen. Right. So before <laughs> jumping into the action, Pamela, maybe you want to introduce yourself. Hi, Firefly fam. My name is Pamela, and I am. Pamela on YouTube, Pamela P with two L's, and so I'll spell my name P A M E L L A. <laughs> um, and I'm also on Instagram at houseplant, H A U Z P L A N T. I make plant content, I make funny videos, I make very real videos about plants, and I just all around like to enjoy myself and come online and be the person that I want to watch. You know, be somebody that brings joy and makes my day better so yeah so, applause Hi, for Pamela. <laughs> okay so today should be really really fun actually we already filmed another part of our collab on Pamela's ch channel so if you are jumping in here for the first time please don't forget and after this video go to my description box down below where I will link our another collab that will be on Pamela's channel and this was so much fun we actually filmed it yesterday and it was yesterday. insane <laughs> It was insane. Oh gosh, it was so insane. Many laugh. <laughs> so much. We started the video off with me just spraying the whole everything with the champagne. With fireworks, and... you know? <laughs> <laughs> it was so much fun. So but, you really need to see that, guys. <laughs> yes, so check it out after you watch this one. Obviously. <laughs> Okay, but right now, let's get to our plans and projects. So, I had two ideas for my little cat, well, fairy garden, but personally for me, um, when I look at the fairy gardens, the plants that are supposed to be in them, I'm not very interested in those type of plants. You know, like the, I don't even know, but the ones that Ferns, require a lot of humidity. Maybe. Yeah, yeah, all, exactly those. <laughs> and I'm, those are not really my cup of tea. 
So I decided, you know what, I might want to do one for my office to bring to my job. So I've had this uh, little greenhouse, glass house thing that I got on sale maybe two years ago at a store called Pier One um, for maybe like 12 30 12 to, I don't know. This but it was, a, it was a good price. <laughs> yeah, so I got it on sale because the store was closing down. So I didn't spend any money on this one because it was already in my collection. I also, I'm not too sure if I want to use one of these larger flat terracotta pots, but I'll see with the amount of plants. I don't think this will fit enough. So for the stuff that I did purchase, I went to the dollar store. And these were the only little things they had available. So a little pond, <laughs> a little door, and this little staircase of just like... like Wood. Oh okay, this is so sweet. You know, funny story. I was looking for something similar, and there was nothing yeah. like that. So I nothing. bought a fridge magnet. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah, smart. Yeah, I need to work with what I have. You know, so this is actually that's smart. A castle in Lithuania. At the same time, that's it's cool. flat. You know, it's a magnet. <laughs> it's flat. Yeah, yeah. So I don't know if that will work, in. but yeah. I also have this little guy. So I had a, whole, a bunch of these. I can't find them anywhere in my house. But I might cheat a little bit after the video <laughs> and look for them and then put them <laughs> inside. But I already have them, okay? I already have them. I have a couple of them. So I didn't spend any money on this. But I went and I picked up this cactus. Right? And then I got another one. And I'm also going to remove this yellow thing off because it's plastic and we don't need it. It's pointless. I also picked up this beautiful little, like, it's like a pink aloe situation oh wow i think it's christmas carol aloe i have yeah very similar christmas in my carol. office i have like <laughs> christmas something Mix. aloe you heard svetlana i mean um, don't I take got... my word for granted <laughs> i think it is <laughs> and then i got these three little i got this is another aloe this is a haworthia some spider webs haworthia i think and then i don't know what these are but they're so cute and then I also have from my collection, this is just from a very sad, succulent little thing that I forgot to water because I tend to not water my plants very often. And, and Oh, I remember I don't this think... one from your cactus collection video. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> um, and lastly, I have just some sand to, you know, maybe try to sand it up and have soil and other stuff that's all i have said what do you have i oh you already oh, i actually right? already showed but i also have some beach sand from lithuania that i did not show i just remembered that i have one so why not to use it you know <laughs> i went to target and they had none of those i was looking for those little kid things and they didn't have anything i'm like you're embarrassing me right now <laughs> this is not <laughs> fair <laughs> <laughs> I actually went to the Maxima, which is really similar to your shop. It's just completely, you know, like grocery store, but they have like 20% mm -hmm. of big box store things, you know? Okay. And I mm -hmm. went in the plant section and the first half was completely empty almost. There was sad, you know, orchids that are already overbloomed. And I was like, okay, this is a disaster already. <laughs> this is, yeah, yeah. But then I went to another site and it was filled with cactus with on a discount, so... <laughs> I was oh. really lucky to get some small ones, you know? Those are so cute! What? I mean, this one is really, really oh, dangerous. Oh, I want I, that! I got a glass for drinks. That is so cute. <laughs> that is even so cute. I needed so this cute. one yesterday to make, you know, <laughs> These little plastics that you get from the grocery store to add your fruits and your vegetables. So I'm just gonna use it to line the bottom of mine. Yeah, that's really smart. 
I actually, since I'm using the glass container, which is you no know, simple waste for flowers, I filled my potting soil with uh, activate, activated charcoal because no, perfect. You don't want any rot. And as well, I had at home lots of perlite and some pebbles. So they're like, I mean, it's clay pebbles, but they're purple. So this should look fun, you know? So actually the worst part is when I need to layer things in glass containers, I'm not sure how they will look. For example, if I will put in those big large clay pebbles and then on top of light or soil, they will be just full filled with the soil and you won't even see the pebbles. Yeah, yeah, so, that's true. So I think maybe what you can do, right? Well, I can't give her tips, right? Of course you can. I'm not giving her tips. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> I, I'm not giving her tips. <laughs> okay, okay, game is on. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you get them. You suggest, oh, hey, maybe, oh, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just keep doing what you do. Um, can I ask you some questions, Miss Firefly? Okay, actually, yesterday we filmed Q&A on Pamela's channel, but with little twist, we were uh, drinking a little bit, little bit recording. Oh my gosh. Know, and we oh were so much, you know, talkative and laughing that we almost forgot to answer most of your questions. <laughs> okay, so I think we came, like, maybe like a total of like 30 questions, maybe, because, you know, we're supposed to have a certain amount, but just like have extra, ex I just had like just some extras. So, I think we maybe answered two questions. <laughs> and one mine. <laughs> and one. <laughs> so, at least you know it was a success. fun video. It, I think it was, it, was a, it was a very success, okay? <laughs> success could be just be measured by the um, person with the tape. Exactly. So, I just filled my container with perlite in the bottom and then pebbles on the top and it looks already pretty fun i'm pretty excited i can't believe yesterday basically i drank this entire thing by myself and i'm sorry people don't judge me but i'm the only one drinking from this and it's almost done so so heck yeah cheers cheers to that <laughs> i actually was so nervous to talk live you know from with somebody from new york <laughs> new so I said, york Can we have some drinks <laughs> So I added some perlite. I also have some activated charcoal. Whoa. That I'm adding into this. Non-sponsored. Hopefully one day. One day, right? <laughs> Hopefully one day. I filled my container as well. My glass should be same, maybe not container. Oh, look how beautiful this looks, y'all. This looks so deserty. Very yes. cactusy. Very cactusy. <laughs> Is that the word? No. <laughs> it's the word in the salty pecan firefly dictionary. Uh, it might be a little tough. I, I have See, to oh, you're so good. <laughs> okay. The first plant, Crassol, is going to be bought. Yep. Ooh, so ooh, ooh. The roots are so root bound. Yeah. See? The roots on this. Funny story, so funny story today when I was go driving with a bus. Actually, today I was driving with a bus after really long break mm -hmm. because you no know, corona and stuff. Yeah. So when I was driving, I saw my classmate. Mm -hmm. And I was like, oh my gosh, maybe should I go there and talk with her and stuff, you know? And she just made like look like she didn't even see me. <laughs> I was like, Bitch. okay. Bitch. Wow. <laughs> That's rude. That's so rude. <laughs> That's so rude. This is my highlight of the day. Of the day. <laughs> my highlight of the day is filming this video. Oh, this is so sweet. <laughs> this is actually my favorite part to make, you know, some kind of composition. We are just making art, you know? We are. <laughs> do we have chopsticks? <laughs> I do, but I'm hard headed, so go. I think I'd rather suffer. This is the last one that's pokey. That's oh. a little. S that's not even a word. Pokey. Oh, oh wow! Just look at that. The roots are coming from the bottom and going all the way up. Look insane. Oh wow! Even look at that. That you is can't beautiful. You can see the soil. You can't. <laughs> it's just engulfed it. 
So I actually put that already a second plant and it look it looks cute already, I think. So I think y'all I might have to use this one. I think this might be a little too big um for my cactus in general. It's it would just look too spread out and I don't think I have enough of them. It shows in the camera. So I think I'm gonna downgrade. Well, only right now I find out that this cactus actually have a succulent friend in the pot. Oh, <laughs> cute! I have a stowaway too. Look at my oh, little one. Let me show you your mine. Here's mine. Oh my gosh! <laughs> That's perfect for fairy garden. <laughs> Literally perfect for fairy garden. It is a fairy. So sweet. Oh my gosh! Those fireworks are so loud. Like Did I can even yeah. It's insane. I didn't hear them yesterday, but now I hear them. I mean, right now they're much closer. To oh, okay. I, oh mean, my God. I even can see people who are shooting them. You know. Where's Rocky? Is he okay? Uh, my boyfriend took him to his okay. home, you know, to not be loud. Okay. When we're able to do a little bit more traveling, what country would you want to go to, like first? Italy. Italy, ooh, where yes, in Italy? I love pasta, I love pizza, I love mm -hmm. wine. So, <laughs> so Italy is my favorite place that I've traveled to. My num, right. I love Rome so yeah, much. Right now I want it even more. Yes, <laughs> so much more. For me, I think I would want to go to Greece. Okay. I would want to go to Greece. I've never been there, but that's just like one of my wish list places, and I would have gone, but you know. I actually was in Cyprus Island, <gasps> which is, you know, very close to Greece, and mm -hmm. half of the Cyprus Island is, like, filled with Greek traditions and food. Wow. And the other half is with Turkish traditions okay. and food. Okay. So it's, you know, very mu multicultural place. Yeah. And I was only on the Greek side because there was, you know, some bad stuff happening in the Turkish side. Mm -hmm. So I almost it almost felt like I was in Greece, you know? <laughs> really? The places, the beaches, everything looked so similar. And the funniest part that so many Lithuanians were in there. <laughs> really? I was like walking by the street and only could hear, you know, people talking in Russian or in Lithuanian. Lithuanian. And I was like, what the hell? <laughs> Where the heck am I? Yeah. So one waiter, you know, was Lithuanian, but he did not know that we were Lithuanians as well. You okay? Oh, yeah. <laughs> so I remember we were, you know, uh, talking with each other, with my boyfriend, and he went to the bar and was talking something about us, mean, you know, and we, when he came back to us, we were like, wow, that was rude, and he rude. went all red. <laughs> Asshole. Good for him. Yeah. Good for him. People are so rude. That's that's like a really really fun fun thing about I guess like knowing other languages people they just look at you and they They would never know and that's happened a few times like people will look at you and think like oh They don't speak one language. They only they they look black so they don't speak You know another language, but no I actually Speak more languages than you can so um, With almost polyglots, you know, yeah, <laughs> which is so fun. It's awesome. I mean I, and what is the funniest part that each of us speak completely different languages? Completely, you know? but English is still our little common, our common. At least, at least one. At least one. At least. I one. mean, you speak Russian a little bit. Just, just a little bit. Just a little bit. I'm a little proud of it. <laughs> fun fact. Um, right? Fun fact. So let's have a let's have a little conversation in Russian. <laughs> this is gonna be so embarrassing for me. <laughs> You're saying, oh my gosh, but imagine me. <laughs> All right. Привет. Привет, Svetlana. Как дела? Привет, добрый день. Uh, все нормально. Yeah, хорошо, хорошо. Um, как тебя зовут? <laughs> Svetlana. Я только что сказала, что меня зовут Svetlana. Sí, <laughs> да, да, да. Хорошо, хорошо, хорошо. Um, um, меня зовут Pamela. <laughs> Приятно познакомиться. Да, да, да. I mean, my, my parents will love this part. <laughs> Because most of the time when I watch my videos, they always say, I have no idea what they're saying, I just look what you're showing. Yeah. <laughs> so, right now it will be like a party for them. <laughs> all, the, all your Russian speakers are going to be like, oh my gosh, what is this crazy 
Whoa. Woman doing. Who does she think she is? Stop. You sound crazy. No, you, you sound perfect. This is the funniest part that you... Oh, wow. That hurt you. Oh, be careful. That you don't even almost have an ac accent. Thank no, you. This is, this is, this Thank is you. awesome. I mean, I cannot run from my Russian oh, accent. Oh, yeah. It's impressive. Oh, I think I have a great Russian accent. But, you know, we're not going to do that. Oh, my gosh, Vedlano, you're done already. Not, not yet. I mean, I'm going in there for the day. In Beautiful. Oh, because that is so cute. Uh, but... That is so cute. <laughs> I love that Cheers. your champagne is closing like uh, a bottle. Like lemonade, mm -hmm. huh? Yeah, awesome. Really awesome. Mm. <laughs> this is the first time my viewers see me, you know, drink it. <laughs> really? Oh. Yeah, so this will be fun to read all of the comments. <laughs> Actually, my um, aunt called me today and she was like, oh my gosh, my mo uh, she talked with my mom and she's my mom's sister. Mm -hmm. And she was like, did you give interview for the New Yorker yesterday? Oh, <laughs> that is so cute. <laughs> oh. She's like, you're speaking with America. <laughs> <laughs> your sister but looks like, just oh like your gosh. aunt. I think your yeah, sister looks like that. your aunt a lot. I say that to her as well, and she gets very mad every single time. Oh. <laughs> no, she looks just like. Because at first I thought that was your mom. And then you're like, oh, this is my aunt, and she's raised me just like a daughter, and, you know, she helped me out so much, you know, in my life, and she was there for me a lot. And I'm like, oh. She's the best. The best. We actually talk every single weekend. Wow. We used to talk all, like every two or three days. Mm -hmm. But then, you know, I got busy with YouTube. I need to, you know, to film, okay. to edit, to okay. work with my, you know, uh, regular work. Mm -hmm. It's a little bit insane right now. Mm -hmm. So we still speak every single weekend. Actually, just before filming this video with you, I spoke with her. Okay. <laughs> She's like, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. You're doing another <laughs> interview with the New Yorker. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Like, oh my gosh, <laughs> she was like, You will be the one in our family who will, you know, reach something. <laughs> yes, amen. Thank you, Auntie. Thank you, Auntie. Let her know. So how do you say aunt again? How, how do you say aunt in Russian? Chocha. Spicyva chocha. Svetlana. Speaking of. Before and after. <laughs> Speaking of. Cheers. Oh. Cheers. 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 Ding. <laughs> All right, my my alcohol is done. Oh, <laughs> is it still good the second day? The champagne, does, does it yeah, have the bubbles. <laughs> Cause you know it's like with the lemonade oh, top, okay. so mm -hmm. it closed it tight. You know the funny phrase in Lithuanian we say when uh, alcoholic drinks. Or, you know, just the bubbly drinks, like soda, mm -hmm. for example, when they don't have bubbles anymore after a couple of days, you know, of just having an open bottle, right? Yeah. Would mm -hmm. you say that it farted out? Ew. That's true. <laughs> That's so true. And it's the best day. It's the best day. It's the best day. Nice lessons over here. <laughs> nice lessons. I'm going to make sure not to curse so your grandparents don't. I mean, they wouldn't understand that. <laughs> no, no, not in English. Oh, oh. Remember, I remember I showed you my 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 skills. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, yesterday was insane. Okay, I yesterday saw so was many it. different things I would never think I would. <laughs> With Pam, <laughs> this is insane. And yes, I loved it. yes, yes. It was so fun. It was, I'm so happy that we're doing these videos. Gosh, I think we all of you need to think about another course. <laughs> yes, we do. Let us know in the description if you're enjoying this, right? Let us know in your comment section um, if you want to see more videos, what kind of videos you'd want to see. Yes, let us know and we'll deliver. Let us. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. With passion, with love. With passion, love. lots of laughter. Passion, <laughs> love. That's why yes. we are here. What is your actually, in what year have you born? I am actually a pig. I 25. think I'm the rooster. Oh, we have one. Look. I actually could 
put them all together so you know <gasps> yes! it would be symbolic, so right? Sweet. Yes! Oh, oh yes! Yeah. <laughs> nice, this is nice. It. So I have my farmy fairy garden. <laughs> and I have mine also. Mine is just a little bit of a desert. Do you, let me oh, show you mine. Oh, this is so cute. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. This is so sweet. Um, with a little gnome to pay, watch anybody to, that's trying to come in and mess up the jungle. <laughs> so, um, I just put in a rooster and a pig. That means that us, so right? Cute. Symbolizes that us. That is so and cute. I'll, and yes. I will put two hearts. Yes, I love it. Yeah. Oh, I'm so happy. Yes. Okay, so are we ready to reveal yes, the final it's garden? The final countdown. countdown. <laughs> okay. On the left. And on the left. Who's on the left? I will be. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I should say so. Okay, so my fairy garden is all finished up in this beautiful glass container. I'll That's insert beautiful. some pictures so you will see it a little bit better. But oh my gosh, this is and... extremely fun. But right now, let's see my opponent in another corner of the ring. Oh my gosh, I love how so I have it works my little so differently with our plants. I our love plants. how they came out. Right, oh my gosh, so sweet. And this is lo this looks like the perfect present, right? It does. Yeah. Oh. I mean, all I give to my mom, mom right now in every single occasion is another fairy garden. <laughs> fairy garden. This is yeah. my first one. My first oh, fairy wow. garden. Yeah. I love it. It's Thank so you, Svetlana. Sweet. I had so much fun filming this. It's so this cute. was insanely fun, and actually, it's so much it, fun. it feels so special to have you making the first fairy garden on this channel. My first fairy garden. <laughs> yes, the fairy garden queen. Thank you. Uh, actually, I just. I loved it. I had so much fun. Right. It doesn't matter who wins, but we'll see in the comments. But it doesn't matter. Yes. <laughs> so again, let's just give them one last show of our fairy gardens. This <laughs> this, mine actually looks like you know almost like a farm but instead of farmhouse i have a castle yes mine i decided not to put the rest of these because there's not much space but i could have like probably fit this somewhere the i mean you stairs. always can make another one so i always can make another one exactly right but thank you so much, Fetlana. This was so much fun. It was. We should right? do this again. Right. So, guys, don't forget to yes. comment who you think should win. Don't forget to comment what else you want. What else do you want to see from us? Because we're more <laughs> than down to do more things like this. Right? Yes, we are. <laughs> this was so much fun. Okay, guys. So we'll say goodbye to you. But after this, probably we'll chat for two hours at least just like we did yesterday yes another two hours we shut down yeah. the cameras <laughs> yes, and just exactly. kept on talking <laughs> just kept talking just kept on talking but anyway oh guys thank you so much for watching don't forget to check out pam's channel salty yes, pecan yes. hi <laughs> go and be a salty pecan if you aren't yet right please don't forget yes, to subscribe exactly. to our channels don't forget to comment yes. let's all chat yes. together in the comment sections yes and right now just go and watch our collab on Pamela's channel. Definitely. If you make, uh, if you get inspired, I guess, by this video and decide to make your own fairy, ga um, fairy garden, uh, definitely tag Svetlana and let her see, you know, how you get inspired and show her, you know, what you've done from this video. Because I think it's amazing to get inspiration from us and then just show the mother of the gardens, you know, what her <laughs> oh children, gosh. her little fireflies have done. She, you know. It, she, right? You guys are her fireflies in her garden. Wow. Okay. <laughs> nice. <laughs> okay. okay, this is amazing. But, I don't want to finish this, but probably for you guys it's more than we enough. Have to. <laughs> but let us know if you want to see us again. Probably one, because why not? Yes. We're amazing. Yes. Why not? We're awesome. We're awesome. Okay, guys. See you later and bye. <laughs>